agriculture especially the indian agriculture is not a sector where you can just you know vehemently just directly introduce corporatization because farmers are not up to that level farmers are not. okay i will give you some provisions of the law so there is this one provision where there is one provision where uh, if there is a dispute between each farmers and corporate okay if there is a dispute between farmers and corporate people will say okay there is mechanism farmers can do they can if if corporate corporate are not good they will take action they will go to government but that is the fear of the farmers and that is why they are protesting because these laws do not talk about on do not talk about those issues that well so uh, uh, like if i talk of like we talk of the talk of the remedies or less the loopholes what according, what according to you like you know like just, just like those said that uh, it was in the congress's manifesto as well and uh, now they are opposing it and uh, so the the uh, has also said that to non bjp states which are protesting in the name of farmers you have addressed it well but like let's like, let's, let's say, say like, like because these are the these things are the people are going to argue feel what they can do is a very big step government talks about you know like all this one nation one tax one nation one market mm-hmm. you know what they could really do is one nation one msp you know no matter where you go into the country there is same msp all over india every farmer is getting the same price and that is 